Sa mahigpit 7,000 kadiwa na idinaos sa buong Pilipinas, 1.8 milyon na na pamilya ang nakinabang sa mababang presyo ng bilihin. Sa kabuuan, halos 700 milyon piso ang naging benta ng mga ito na nakapagbigay ng hanap buhay sa mga membro ng mahigit 3,000 na kooperatiba at samahan. Maganda ang nakita nating resulta, kaya papalawigin pa natin ang kadiwa sa buong bansa. Kamakailan lamang, kamakailan lamang ay nagsanib pwersa na ang mga ahensya ng pamahalaan upang lalo, lalo pang patibayin ang kadiwa. Katuwang natin dito ang buong sektor ng agrikultura at ang lokal na pamahalaan. Our aim is to boost our local agricultural production through consolidation, modernization, mechanization, and improvement of value chains, augmented by timely and calibrated importation as needed. Nakita natin tumaas ng 2.2% ang sektor ng agrikultura sa unang tatlong buwan ng, ng taong ito. In our quest for food security, our methods are now more guided by science and the balance of nature so that production is both sustainable and responsible, benefiting both this and future generations. Our fisheries codes must be, revi must be revised to incorporate and strengthen science-based analysis and determination of fishing areas. This approach will protect both the interests of our fisherfolk and our fisheries and aquatic resources. To this end, we will seek the support of Congress to amend the code to guarantee sustainable development of our fishery sector in harmony with environmental balance.